In this tutorial, we'll show you how to make changes and adjustments in cards using the custom CSS feature. We'll create a smooth scrolling one page website with a sticky menu. We will want to link smooth scrolling to the portfolio menu item block for our content. Let's start with smooth. Click the menu block and choose Edit Menu Items. WordPress Menu Editor will open in a new window. Here we'll open the portfolio item and type pound portfolio. That word will be the starting point of smooth scrolling. Remember it. Save the menu and go back to the visual editor. Edit the desired block and where the scrolling effect will stop. Select this block, click it, and choose custom CSS. For this block, we'll edit the HTML. Now, remember, if you edit the HTML, you can't use the inline editor for this block. In our example, we'll edit the HTML. Find the container class and add the ID that we mentioned in the menu previously. So in our case, the ID is Portfolio. Click Save and go back to the visual editor. Click Save again so we can see the result. Click the Preview button and open it in the Browser tab. Now click Portfolio. We'll scroll to the desired block, but the scroll looks too fast, so let's go ahead and fix that. Open the WordPress dashboard and click Card Settings. Here we'll see the Add Code to Head. In this section, we'll add the JavaScript that will make a smooth scrolling effect. We've prepared this code and we'll copy and paste it here. We'll share this code in the description of this video so you can copy and paste it into your websites as well. Now, click Save, and let's look at the result. Open the page and refresh it. Click Portfolio, and you can see a more smooth transition to the desired block. But this effect was still a little bit too fast, so we'll change the time of smooth scrolling in the JavaScript. Go back to Card Settings, and change this number. We'll increase it to see a difference. Now, go back to the page and refresh. Click the portfolio, and the effect slowly will scroll down to the block. In this style, you can link every menu item to the desired block. OK, now we'll make a sticky menu. Generally, the sticky menu is necessary for smooth scrolling effects. And you can see the menu disappears if you scroll down, and appears if you scroll up. That effect increases the readability of your page. So let's customize it. Click the menu block and choose Custom CSS. Here we'll paste the CSS code that will maintain our sticky menu. We have a ready-made code to paste in. All right, save CSS changes. And click Save in the visual editor. Let's check the page now. Refresh and scroll down. There we go. The menu is fixed. Perfect. You can easily customize cards, animations, and transitions if you know the basics of coding. We hope this tutorial has pointed you in the right direction.